Hi, let's look at how to configure the vertical spacing in a Swift UI list. We are going to use two modifiers, list row spacing for adjusting the adjacent vertical rows and the list section spacing modifier, which can be used to adjust the various adjacent section spaces you see over here. Let's begin with list row. In this example, I have a list containing three different sections, customization, more actions, and privacy and support. To adjust the vertical spacing for each of the list items for the sections, we will use the list row spacing modifier. Let's set it to, for example, 20. You can see we have adjusted the vertical row spacing of the list items. To adjust the vertical section spacing, we will use the list section spacing modifier. With this, we have different options. Let's begin with default. With default, we don't see any change at all. That is the same as when we don't have the modifier applied. Let's change it to compact. With compact, we get a vertical section spacing, which is much smaller than the default. We can also use a custom value. So let's change it to, for example, 60. And that widens the vertical section spacing a lot. This is how to adjust the vertical spacing for all the sections in the list. We can also apply the vertical spacing to only a specific section in the list. For example, let's adjust the vertical spacing between the customization section and the more actions section. I will click here to expand the code. With that, we need to select the first section, which is this one. So over here, I will add the list section spacing modifier. Let's use a custom value, for example, 60, or a larger value like 100. You can see that widens only the vertical space between the customization section and the more actions section. So with this, we will end here. This is how you can adjust the vertical spacing within a Swift UI list using the list row spacing modifier and the list section spacing modifier. Thanks for watching.